Streaming now, this is the Wood TV Live Desk. And good afternoon, everyone. Phil Panarski here with the Wood TV Live Desk. Hope you're having a great day so far. The city of Wayland is looking to help fight childhood hunger, and there's a way for you to actually step up as well. And all you have to do is eat some sandwiches and other handheld items. We are now being joined by Holly McPherson. She's the executive director of Downtown Wayland, and she's here to tell us all about the Between the Buns competition. Holly, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you for having me. Of course, of course. And uh, first off, I know a lot of people uh, want to know a little bit more about the competition itself. So for those aspects, first and foremost, uh, there's about a dozen restaurants involved. Tell us a little bit more about the Between the Buns competition. Yeah, so the Between the Buns competition was started um, the whole entire month of January to kind of help our restaurants during a time that they struggle just with uh, people doing, uh, you know, not eating out and things. But one of our promotional team decided that we should have a charity aspect to it as well. So we have 11 restaurants in the Wayland area that are participating with different sandwiches. And you can go around, try them all, and every sandwich, $1, will be uh, donated to the Hand Hand. And I do want to touch on that philanthropy aspect in a little bit, for, but first, Holly, um, there is a way for people to actually have a little bit more fun with this, the way for them to get involved and kind of, you know, cast their vote for maybe their favorite handheld item. Talk a little bit about that aspect of the competition. Yeah, so we have an open competition right now. So when you go around, you try the sandwiches, you can vote, and then we take the top five sandwiches and we have a panel of judges that will go around and pick the winner. Um, and hopefully the winner will get a really big trophy. We haven't decided exactly what we're going to do yet, but there'll be a really nice prize for them. Mm -hmm. And we're looking at some of the photos of some of those items that are up for the top choice, top sandwich, top handheld item in the Wayland area. They all look incredible. Um, and now kind of switching over just a little bit uh, to that philanthropy part of this whole competition. You mentioned a dollar from every handheld sold during the month of January at these participating restaurants will go to the hand-to-hand -hand program. Uh, why was that part added to the competition? Why was it important to have this uh, community aspect where it's not just bringing people into these restaurants, but it's also helping the community as well? Yeah, so when we decided to pick a charity, um, we decided since we were eating that maybe we should help fight childhood hunger through eating. So the hand to hand program has a strong presence in the Wayland area and one of our local churches does a great job helping pack the backpacks. So we thought that it would be great to donate back to our community through the hand to hand program. Mm -hmm. And for everybody watching, all the information you need regarding this competition, all the participating restaurants, uh, ways to keep track of your order, even to vote, everything you need to know is over on our website for you, uh, woodtv.com. Holly, before we let you go, obviously this competition already a couple days in. It lasts throughout the rest of January, so a lot of people are probably going to be heading out to some of these restaurants, um, but not just for the business owners that are participating, not just for Hand to Hand, which is receiving a great deal of the portions from this, and not just the residents who get to you know partake in this competition. What exactly is your hope for everybody involved uh, regarding the uh, Between the Buns competition? Um, well, overall hope is just a fun competition, but we really wanted to get people from around West Michigan that maybe haven't been to Wayland to try our wonderful restaurants. We have grown a lot of restaurants and have a lot of unique places here. And I feel that getting people into the downtown, trying sandwiches and just seeing what we have in Wayland would be a great result. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Well, fantastic stuff. Holly, thank you so much for stopping by. I do want to remind everybody one last time that everything you need to know regarding the Between the Buns competition in Wayland can be found over on our website, woodtv.com. If you're watching us on Facebook, just head on over to the comments section or the description box. You'll be able to find a link directly there. Holly, one last time, thank you so much for stopping by today. We really do appreciate it. Thank you. Of course. And I want to thank everybody else for tuning in to this latest edition of the Wood TV Live Desk. I'm Phil Panarski, and we hope you have a great rest of your day.